order for you guys to use the magic wand, one of the first things you guys have to do is have something on your screen. So whether you use the backdrop tool or you import in the bitmap, once you select the file, then you have to choose the stitch type. Not all stitch types work with the magic wand. So run stitch, of course, steel, the classic satin, it does not, but the satin stitch, which is the other satin that comes only in Lux, you're able to use it. So once you select it, then when you see the wand appear, then you're able to go in and actually use a magic wand. So I just want the outer portion of this strawberry to be the satin. So that's what I did here. And I'm just going to change the color. And there it is. Okay. And then if I wanted to change up the stitch type, but still use a magic wand, all I have to do is make sure I choose a different stitch type. And then let's say I want to go in and I want to change the color. You can go in and do so just like this here. Tango, we're using Tango. And then there it is. So I have a satin on the outside and I have a complex on the inside. And then let's say I want to go one step further and I want to hit applique. I can do so. And then I'm going to make me some of the seeds, change the color up again, just so we can see Put that there. And as you can see, I can make all of these or the whole thing you can go back in. Let's say I didn't like it that way. Right click on it, convert to, say I want to change it to a satin. Now it's a satin. Same thing with all the other ones as well. You're able to do so.